Hello guys and welcome back. Today I'll be recreating 10 famous Scratchers Minecraft skins. The links to their profiles will be in the description below. Make sure to watch to the end to see Boy McBoy's Minecraft skin. Anyways, let's get on with the video. Now Hunted Skelly's skin was very fun to make as it was very easy to do using his 3D art test with his character being shown from all three dimensions. This allowed me to make sure that this skin was the best it could be, highlighting all of its all of his character's details. Now making Malamation's skin was tricky, mainly because it had mainly to straight colors and it was really hard to properly shade it without making it look weird. I tried to take inspiration from a skin I had seen earlier in the day, but it just wasn't working for me, so instead I ended up just texturing the whole thing. skin was one of the tougher ones, mainly because his original character had nothing to do with what I was trying to create, so I had to start from scratch. No pun intended. In the end, I think it turned out really nice. The hair definitely was tricky to do, but I think in the end I was, I'm quite happy with how it turned out. Notice that Scratchcraft has lost two of its scratchers. I would be very happy to join if asked, and honestly am asking to join. I would really enjoy it, and yeah. This skin really didn't have anything wrong with it, but I still didn't want to leave leave them out, so I decided that I would do something that I had noticed. The helmet on the knight had not been properly done and did not fit with the rest of the skin, so I cleaned it up a little bit. skin, I was messing around with their name MC profile, and I found that before they used the skin they were using currently, they had used this really cool, nice, clean, clean cut, and really good skin. So I decided to recreate it, because apparently they had already liked it once, so they would probably like it like this. It has been completely revamped to be just like their character. <laughs> Wild Crazy Goose's skin was already really nice and I could tell that they had made it themselves. And I really was struggling to find anything to really do with it, so in the end I simply made it so that it could be ultra shaded in the best way possible by using big blocks of color. I sort of argued with myself for what color the shirt is, but in the end I think it still looked pretty good.
probably would mispronounce this scratcher's name, so I'm not even gonna try. But, in the end, his skin was a default Steve, and so I decided to make it look a little bit more like his character while keeping the Steve features intact. As you notice, I pretty much just recolored his shirt and gave him the skin color of his character. Now, Myth's skin really took a long time, as I also had to build it straight up from scratch, and I couldn't really find their, their uh, Minecraft username. So I built it from scratch based around their profile picture, and it, I think it turned out really nice. It's sort of reminiscent of Grian's skin with the big eyes and, well, the hair color in particular. And I really liked what I did with the jacket, I think it turned out really nice. Scratcher's skin also was created from scratch. I definitely could t tell that he had put a lot of effort into it, or at least tried to make it. it. In the end, I think it turned out really nice, and Mr. Melon was given a proper reshading in the long run. finally at Boy McBoy's skin. So with this, I really wanted to keep a lot of its original features intact while giving it hair. If you didn't notice, the normal version of Boy McBoy's skin is bald. And well, either he is completely bald or he's hiding a bit underneath that turtle shell of his. So I gave him a fresh set of hair. I also kept his shirt original and I tried to keep the same lines of shading as I really could tell that he had tried very hard with this skin. We're not going to talk about how he has a second layer of his pants. guys thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed this video links to all the skins and the scratchers that made it will be inside the description and uh yeah don't forget to like and subscribe and thanks for watching oh and by the way i'd really like to be in scratchcraft like really pretty please let me in